Oh, hi there, and welcome to Flats 15 for round one of this season's Premiership Rugby Cup. In the front row, Lewis Boyce, really like watching this guy. Quinns had another strong game. Todd Gleaver, hooker for Gloucester. I haven't seen a huge amount of him, but what I've seen I've really liked. And Logo Mulapola, I know he's a big experience international when he wasn't expecting to play, but I think he turned up expecting to not be doing very much. Got asked to put his boots on because someone had a sore back and actually had a blinder, carried really hard, scrummaged well, good game. In the second row, the obvious choice, the first choice of the whole team is Joel Kapoku, young superstar from England under 20s, playing his first game in the first team for Saracens. What a player. All I'll say is keep your eye on him because you're going to be seeing a lot of that name. In the back row, Callum Clark did really well. Been out for a while, but three turnovers on the floor. Looked nice and abrasive in defence. Good game. Sam Lewis, lovely offloading game. Really good ball in hand for Tigers. And at number eight, another Saracen, Sione Vailanu. Explosive, aggressive, hard to handle, difficult to put down. Could be the ultimate understudy for Billy Brunapola. Alex Mitchell went really close at nine as well for Saints, but it's Ben Bellicott for me at nine for Gloucester. I know he's realistically a first choice player already or close to it, but just looks so sharp, so hard to play against. And fly half, James Grayson looks really, really sharp. And I know Dan Bigger's the top guy at Northampton in the 10 jersey, but I do think Grayson is going to have a role to play this season for the first team at Saints. Look really, really sharp, really balanced. A bit like his dad, actually, but a better bloke. In the midfield, Francois Bento and Luther Burrell. Not too much to say about them, other than they're really good players and they played really well. How's that for a bit of analysis? The back three, Tom Homer had a really good game for Bath. Josh Adams shouldn't really have been playing because he's a first-choice player and he's a rock star, but he looked good anyway. And Zach Kivarigi on the wing for Newcastle scored a hat-trick. He was absolutely sensational with the ball in hand. He's going to push Sonotti, Sonotti and gone ever harder than a lot of people expect this season, I reckon. Hope you like the team. See you next week. Ta-ra.